Well, the city of Brownsville breaking ground on a new project providing access to hike and bike trails. Channel 5's Stephanie Rosales has details on what this new project will bring to the city. Erwin Reisenman rides his bike at least 20 miles every day. Has been doing it for the past two years since the start of the pandemic. And his inspiration? Keeping fit. You know, I'm not getting any younger, so uh, just got to keep healthy. Reisenman starts his trip on Alton Glor Boulevard and makes his way through Caracara Trails, which is 428 miles of trail network throughout Cameron County, a trail that will ultimately connect with the new West Rail Trail. City Commissioner at Large Rose Gowan says the project started because the community wanted access to more green space. She says it will also help more people be active. Increased uh, health parameters throughout the city as opposed to just in those neighborhoods that are around those few existing trails. So the West Rail is going to open up access to all of West Brownsville. I've changed my whole outlook. I'm uh, looking forward to going out every day, get the endorphins pumping when I'm bicycling, and uh, I, I just love doing it. West Rail Trail will provide more than seven additional miles of trail for hikers and bikers. It will begin north of the 77 flea market and go toward Palm Boulevard. And Gowan says it's more than just providing access to trails in neighborhoods that need them. They're also about economic development. And you can see that many communities in the, in the country have um, economic opportunities that thrive along trail networks because it gives a flavor to their business. And for an avid biker like Reisenman, longer trails will help him stay off the road and make him feel safer. Unfortunately, if the trails were longer, like uh, in some larger metropolitan areas, it would be a lot more advantageous. And I, I think a lot more people would utilize the trails as well. The project is set to start later this month, and Gowan hopes it will be finished in less than a year. In Brownsville, Stephanie Rosales, Channel 5 News at 6.